It's so big. That's so big. She's changed. She's changed. I, I don't even know you anymore. <laughs> you want Wait, to see Paul his reaction? About this? Is that a tattoo? Okay. I'm getting a tattoo. <laughs> Um, John and I are getting matching tattoos. Um, we will explain the meaning of them towards later in the video, but we're getting matching tattoos and I'm very nervous. This is something I've been wanting, but I'm like, now's the day. It's all, like we're late to our appointment. It's about to happen. And I'm like really nervous right now. But, um, I guess uh, here we go. Here we go. Here's the choices, <laughs> the sizing. Like right here. Very cool. <laughs> and then I'm getting mine right below the tiger. Like yeah, there. down there. So, so then when we hold hands, you'll be able to see both of them. Like that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you scared of the <laughs> I'm scared. Oh, it feels good, doesn't it? So I'm gonna put less detail, and then if you think you need more detail and make it darker, then just come back, okay? Because once it's too dark, there's no way back. All right. Yeah. <laughs> I think I like the small yeah, one. Yeah, right? I feel like it looks better. If it's too big, it will look like mother and child. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't, want, I don't that. want that. It's gonna look like the tiger's <laughs> eating the hummingbird. Oh, yeah. Another friend. He's playing with the hummingbird. Let's go, we'll posture. It's going to look more like that or more like this. You'd be... Oh, you mean like, like the, the shading? <laughs> I mean the shading. Yeah, but it's going to be lighter than that. Yeah. Okay. You ready? Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Do people say that this, that this area hurts the most? No. no. Ribs. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, just a little. Head scratch. Like a scratch. Nothing, right? Yeah. You okay? Head scratch, yeah. Whose idea is it? <laughs> Guilty. The monkey's tail is looking really good. <laughs> no, oh. he, he's tearing so on. Mm. It looks so good. Wow. I know, how cool. Incredible. You happy with it? I think so. You think so? Okay, she's done. Here's wow. Out. I will say it was a little bit more painful at the end, but she said that was because of the white. She put some white detail in there. So, yeah. Oh, we're done. All done. <clears throat> and Django Fett is fighting Obi-Wan. All right, all done. Okay, How do you feel? Good. It feels so weird. I mean, like now it feels like nothing happened. But <laughs> so you didn't think it wasn't all that painful for you? No, it wasn't. I you thought, did a great job. Okay, now it's John's turn. Right there. That's where he's going. Matching with mine. Ooh. Look like you're ready for a massage. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the little stickers. Oh, the little sticker lover. All right, let me show the final product when it's done. All right.
right, so here's the final product. That's so cute. <laughs> tattoos we did it we did it we um did it. i'm gonna now go see ronnie and show her my tattoo okay so i'm here oh and gosh. i was greeted by some lovely guests <laughs> okay i'm ready dog. i'm wait am i supposed to pretend to not know what's happening i do know what's you happening. do know okay, what's okay. happening <laughs> <laughs> we're not <laughs> pretending we're being like, real okay okay Tattoo. I've been anxious all day to hear about it. Okay. Really? Yes. Okay. I don't know if it hurt. First of all, did it hurt? So here's how it felt like. Like, have you ever drawn on your skin, like in this area, with a mark, like a pen? I don't feel like I'm gonna pass out. <clears throat> You're not gonna pass out. I hate needles. Yes. Yeah. So, and you know how it feels kind of tender? Yeah. Yeah. So imagine that, just like times two. So it wasn't like awful. No, but that's a weird feeling too. But it, it wasn't awful. It wasn't. But it wasn't super painful. Oh my gosh! I feel like you're a new person. Like I don't even know you anymore. <laughs> We're not even twins. What? Okay, show me. Here we, here we go. <gasps> it's so big. I thought you said little. <laughs> <gasps> oh my gosh! It's so pretty. So I'm not filming. It's so pretty. <gasps> Did it hurt? That didn't. Hurt. I mean, it was, it kind of hurt, but like not a lot. I didn't cry. It's so pretty. This is a, uh, what, what John and I ended <gasps> up doing. Oh, it's so pretty. So when we oh. hold hands, they like face each other. Oh, it's so cute. Have you shown anyone else? No. I'm the first. Yes. Oh my goodness. And I'm showing daddy tomorrow. But Okay, you ready to show Aaron? That's so big. Uh, I know. Everyone's it's so much oh, bigger. Oh, yeah. when you whoa, it's so big. It's cool though. The details are crazy. Yeah, oh, they messed up right it. here. I'm joking. <laughs> you can't Isn't it too. cute? That's really nice. Want it? Like I really wanted as much detail as possible, and she said she could go smaller, but we would have lost a lot of the detail, and specifically her work is just. <gasps> Oh, oh, oh. Stay! <laughs> Paul, do not enter! Uh. Big surprise. If it's Guppy dressed up as a pink little That's later. Christmas. Where am I at? Hey, there's right steps. We're good. Am I good right here? Okay. Ready? Okay, open your eyes. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh, you <laughs> turned that on your Is that a tattoo? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. I know, right? It's so little. Mm. <laughs> He's the first one to say it's little. Huh? Mm. It's a hummingbird. Mm. <laughs> you should be thinking. Mm. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. You guys want to see Aaron's tattoo? You don't have a tattoo. He does have a tattoo. Where is it? Nothing. <gasps> <laughs> okay, let's no, go back. it's fine. <laughs> It's that little the, frack, it's the little it's dot. Frack, it's, the moon. it's the it's, it's the earth dot. from a really long way out. Aaron did it for a video, but he didn't want anything, so he got a dot. He got a dot. <laughs> like this is just super meaningful, which I need to explain what it means now, so people understand why I got a little hummingbird. One month later. Yes, it's been a month since we filmed us getting tattoos. That was my voice, by the way. <laughs> and um, we did announce that we got married. And it's funny because during this whole video, we were actually hiding John's ring because That's we right. didn't know when we were announcing that we were married or mm -hmm. not. But, um, but yeah, so it's been a month. Here's how they've healed. They've healed so nicely. Yeah, mine is right there. Let's get some light on it. There it is. Both tattoos have healed very nicely. Yeah. Um, and so now we're finally going to talk about the meaning. Yeah. There's kind of a story to it. So John, you go first. I think, so I think it started from, for me, uh, hummingbirds just always kind of reminded me of uh just trying to stay um stay ready to hear god's voice um i i pray quite a bit 
um, I start my days like that. I, I end my days like that. And, um, and I feel like if you're someone who tries to kind of hear God back, um, you kind of have to always put yourself in a place where you're, you're, you're able to do that. Meaning like get distractions away, you know, don't, um, try and get in a place where you're not thinking about other stuff and there's not, you know, you're not messing with your phone. It's like, you have to be ready for it and you have to be looking for it and, um, you should be listening for it. And hummingbirds, uh, I just saw a similarity there, um, because hummingbirds are kind of elusive. Um, and they're very quiet, you know, and they're little and they're, they're adorable and they're very beautiful, but they're kind of elusive. So you, you kind of miss them if you're not looking for them. Um, and so I don't know for like a while that like when I see hummingbirds, I've, it just kind of reminds me of, um, like kind of listening for God, like what, like what, what, what is God trying to tell me right now? Like, um, and they just remind me, remind me of, of listening to his voice. And I shared that with you. I don't know when we if it was when we started dating or well because i asked you what your next tattoo was going to be mm. oh yeah yeah true you said shark tiger and then hummingbird and i was like yeah hummingbird because you know they're just so cute and little and i just was like very confused as to why john would get a hummingbird and each of his tattoos have a really cool meaning behind them and so he explained that that was the meaning of the hummingbird that it kind of represents God, you know, and sometimes God just totally will like just show you clear signs of what you're supposed to do in life and kind of like a hummingbird, he'll or he, she will just appear in front of you and you're like, Wow, there it is and there it is and now it's gone. It's yeah. like, but if you're not looking, you could miss a hummingbird. It's so fast because they're so fast. Yeah, like, it's kind of real like, quick. It's kind of like how God works sometimes. It's like he's always there, but you might miss what he's talking about or what he's trying to tell you if mm. you're not listening or paying attention. Um, right. So, later on in our relationship, um, I uh, started to journal every morning um, and pray, and like John, <laughs> um, because that's something I wasn't really doing a good job at, do, like doing that at all, really. So I started to do that, and every day I would journal and pray, I would see a little hummingbird in the window our house and um that was every day and then on days when i wouldn't journal or pray i wouldn't see a hummingbird so it just there was then started to just a lot of experiences with hummingbirds just kept happening where mm -hmm. he would text me saying like hey i was driving and a hummingbird was following my car and it kind of became like something we both then shared yeah. of like oh it's like a little it's like a little wink i like to call it from god so like you know obviously like as we started sharing our relationship with God together, it just became like a really cool thing to share with mm -hmm. each other. Like she would text me like, I saw one outside by the pool this morning. And I'd be like, oh, I saw one when I was driving yeah. and we just kind of bonded over it. Yeah, so that's why we got the hummingbird tattoos because it's part of our testimony and our journey and just um, a reminder that God put us together for a reason. And um, yeah. uh, so yeah, so that's the meaning of the hummingbird tattoo. It's very special <clears> to us. And it's so cute and little. Um, and, you know, let it be a reminder for you guys watching that if you ever see a hummingbird, <clears> that God's looking out for you and he's there. Also, if you're someone who is thinking about getting a tattoo, just since we're talking about this, and I have quite a few at this point, I would just really make sure it has some sort of meaning um, that is close to your heart. Because, man, like... They're no joke and they are permanent. And, um, and obviously like they're so popular nowadays and it like, it's like you can have a cool aesthetic and it's mm -hmm. and not that it doesn't do that. Like obviously like the look of mine is partially why I like them, but I just, you know, whenever people ask me about my tattoos, I just, I always kind of say that disclaimer at the end, which is like, if you are thinking about getting one, like I have a, I have a, a personal meeting for, for every single one. Mm -hmm. Um, I would just encourage that. Cause I think it's, uh, cause you know, you'll you change and your view of you, the, te the the art on your body will change too but as long as those are things that are really really close to your heart like a lot of mine are um about my faith and that's something that to me is eternal so that's not going to change um so i don't have to worry about looking at a tattoo and being like ooh, like that was dumb <laughs> i didn't need to do that <laughs> um well, so same here and you know obviously this is my <clears throat> 
first tattoo and probably only tattoo I will ever get just because it really just... Maybe. <laughs> I mm. don't... No, I don't know. But anyways, that's that. So um, that's the meaning of the tattoo. And um, so yeah, I've got a tattoo now. It's very, very <clears throat> everything's so different. Everything's so different now. I don't so even remember. Different. It's there. <laughs> different people. It's just who even is Vanessa anymore? She's all inked up now. <laughs> all right, that <clears throat> is my tattoo journey. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it and like, like John said, um, the permanent. So be careful. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, subscribe to Merrill Twins. Also subscribe to Butterfly Tiger. Yeah, we're in a band now. We make- That's actually why we got tattoos. <laughs> yes, no. Um, we make music together now. So if you guys wanna check that out um, and see more of our journey together um, as musicians, artists, you can subscribe to Butterfly Tiger channel. Um, check out some of the other videos we've done and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.